Did someone say adventure, exploration, and side quests? Not necessarily in that order? Well, you're in luck then, because that's exactly what's on the menu today. I to it in a Still, I think that the first thing I'm gonna do is travel back to the Nashville Mines and see if I can actually beat the... Uh, yeah, go down here. Because Prison pl Plus Grey Wolf Bastard Hurts. I want to see to ask. if I can actually beat him now, because we have leveled up our dudes somewhat. I think we have spells, and I think Aimwen has a few charges left in uh, her Wand of Magic Missile. We have an actual priest. So maybe, just maybe. Uh, did anyone actually have Hold Person, by the way? Was I smart enough? Or did I just imagine? Yeah, you have hold person. <laughs> I'm gonna try using that one on Grey Wolf. Because Prism is wanted for stealing some jewels, which people want back. So, uh, of course, people want their jewels back. <laughs> so, we're gonna try that. And then we still have the. Cloakwood thingy, the paladin with the half ogres, and the captain who is somewhere in these hills surrounding Nashville. Probably, did I did I ever go up here? I don't even remember where I've been. That's. I should start writing down where I have explored everything, so we don't waste enough too much of my time. Not going to waste much of your time. Because I am going to keep um, just pausing the game while I'm exploring and g bringing it back once something happens. Like for now, we're gonna talk to Prism again. And we've been through this conversation before. I have nothing to do with Grey Wolf. Uh, I shall uh, guard you a special. Ooh. Wait a minute. Um, will I have different. Dialogue options now that I know you are wanted. If it's so important, I should guard you. No, I didn't. Here we stand, garden, and it's. Run cross Grey Wolf and live. Here he is. I've come for your prism. Uh, his work is already done. Your sentiment is wasted. Sentiment is wasted on me, fool. You are but gold in my purse. Do you make the situation worse by helping? I mean. We can still get the jewels back. Just let him... Or did he use the jewels for the master... Ah, oh, let him finish his masterwork. Battle? There we go. Okay. So, let's try and be a little bit tactical about this. Tactical. You, you. Go attack. As will Jaheira, actually. And I... No, you! You? Priest spells? Where... Why did I go in there? This is where you cast spells. You will actually cast Hold Person! Well, Nera... You will... You had the summon... Wonder Monster Summoning. You will cast Magic Missile. And Imwen. You will use the Wand of Magic Missile. We all set? We all set. Go! Let's give them a right okay, uh, I think... That, was that Nira or was that the whole person? If so, did it hit? Let's see. Um, Nira casts Magic Missile. No, that was Nira. Uh -huh. Cast another Magic Missile. If you please. <laughs> now to think of it, Nera kind of sounds a little bit like Mission from uh, Kotar, doesn't she? Just a little bit. M probably not the same voice actress, but the yeah, whatever. Whole person, get fucked. Everyone, kill. Now I'm the one doing hold person. Yes! 1400 experience! Get sh pooped on! Do you, uh, I, I don't know, I hit, I think I accidentally hit my key I keyboard in my excitement. 
Magic weapon, another magic weapon. I do hope that the magic weapons don't actually break. I mean, the, the whole poison iron thingy, the regular weapons still break and the... That is a fix, but the iron can't be shipped anywhere because bandits are still uh, harassing the countryside. We're getting to that eventually. We have to we have to go to Bergost for that. Which uh, incidentally also the Gurk Gurke, whatever. The little halfling guy with the cloak and the paladin are both in Bergost. So I'm gonna do once I have done checked off all these quests and explored enough areas. I'm going to take those back to Bergost and then do everything in one turn. Because I don't want to rush forward again with the whole um, main quest thingy. Yeah, like I said, I do hope that magical weapons don't break. If they if they do, I'm, I'm gonna be upset. I mean, I, can, can I... abilities? The selected item has all of the abilities listed above. You can change the currently selected ability by clicking on one. What's the difference? Small axe or big axe? What? Because this can be thrown and can be melee. Maybe, maybe I should keep using the battle axes until they break. Because I think I... Oh no, maybe they don't, because I, I think, didn't I buy five of those and I only have two? Doesn't matter. Grey Wolf is dead, we killed a bounty hunter. Was it in self-defense, kind of? While guarding a criminal? <laughs> but yeah, just having that hold person and it working immediately. So good. Because I have been on the receiving end of Hold Person so many times. And it feels awful. Okay, so a prism. You have but to ask. Alas, my work is complete. Take what you will from my possessions, but leave the sparkle in her eyes. Oh, sweet creature, my effigy to thee is done. Perhaps our paths shall cross in distant realms, and I shall find the courage to call thy name. Elysim. Okay. Boom. Gorion would be proud of your actions. Ooh. Prism death? What? Perhaps this group needs not quite as much help as I thought. Wait, what the hell happened? Prism's tale turned out to be a sad one, but at least he finished what he felt he must. And it's not finished. But he just died? He, he just walked two steps and died. I was wondering, hmm, didn't I loot Grey Wolf? Then I saw the blue clothes. Then I saw Prism Death. I can take the jewels. I mean, he is wanted for stealing the jewels. Should I return them? Who, who actually? Can I can I get a little bit more information here? Because, uh, please, game. Uh, my my memory is kind of sh not that good. Mm, I rescued Branwen. Minsk is getting impatient. Assassination attempts. Death of Mulahay. Um. Oh, I, I can add, I can add my own entries. Maybe I should do that. Maybe I should treat. Instead of writing things down here. Add entry. Yeah, things uh, things uh, left to do. Um, how, how long can these be? Um, get cloak for Gurke. It is somewhere. 
um, fight half ogres for paladin something or other. Uh, maybe, maybe we should do uh, 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 separate, separate. They are southwest of um, Beregost. Find Captain um, Captain Bra something. He is. I prefer these long periods of relaxation. A lovely day for it. Glad you glad you approve, Khalid. Uh, we're soon done, though. He is um, in hills. Probably. Uh, what else did you have? Then I can, I can, because then I can kind of cross out the captain. I can cross out the paladin. I can cross out the cloak wood. Damned icicles of all. Um, I'm I. Forgot again to look up what lore does. I will not do that right now. Um, prism. I, I can cross out prism. Uh, so, prism. Completed work. Co completed work. It worked. Useful with this time. Jahira. Calm your half heaven tits. Uh, then died. What up? Um, stole jewels. Who bounty? <laughs> it glow for Gurkha. It is somewhere. Okay, so that I do have an in-game journal. Which will kind of get buried by this, but maybe I can just, um... Uh, Gurke? Perfect. Perfect. And then I can just go in and edit the entry and take away everything. Maybe, maybe I, sh I should edit this entry. Um, thing left to do. No. Uh, this is quest log. Yeah, that's what this is. Quest log. Okay, um... But yes, Prism did steal jewels. He completed his masterwork, he's now dead, so I will bring the jewels back. Uh, emerald. And the other emerald. It shall be as because he's dead, and I'm free to do whatever the hell I want. And I say I'm going to take these jewels and return them to their rightful owner, uh, which I guess is actually somewhere in Nashville. Probably the um, rotund uh, bounty dude. I shall attend to it in a trust. Right? Who stands here? Somewhere? No, a little bit, a little bit closer, closer to the barracks. I think he's here. Between the barracks and the church. Nimwen is in front because she detects traps. Traps. Uh, oh, my fine and honest friend, what can I do for you today? What bounties are currently unclaimed? Our captain of the guard is still on the loose. Keep your blade ready if you get anywhere near him. Very dangerous he is. There's also a bit of foolishness with a local artist named Prism. Stole a couple of emeralds he did. We seek their return, though Prism's fate is of little concern. Okay, then I have the bounty for you. I've come to turn in a bounty and collect the reward that is duly mine. A 300 gold bounty for the emeralds! Well, you'll make quite a name for yourself among the bounty hunters if you keep this up. Whether it is for better or worse, I do not know. Probably worse, because I already killed one bounty hunter. We have lost Emerald. Gained 200 experience, 300 gold. And uh, Prism was updated. It is now finished. Prism's story was a sad tale indeed. A shame it could not have had a better ending. Ah, well, I profit in the end. A gold bounty for the Emeralds he stole. I mean, he died, so... Whatever. 
I'm just, I just, why are you, no, you're walking normal speed. Terrace. Oh, you haven't seen the man about him. No, this still, okay, still haven't. This so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to, I'm going to go rest to get all my spells back. All the three spells I used. Hey, three spells. Uh, maybe, maybe I'll die without those three spells. You have but to ask. Then I'll go out and explore again. And see what I can find. And if I find anything interesting, I will get right back to you. But for now, I'll see you in a bit. While we travel at night. Never travel at night. Well, I don't know if this counts as interesting, but what the hell is that? I'm Kig. Attack? Really that kind of looks like a gigantic antlion. Mm, no. It's fine, Khalid. You only took nine damage. Save versus death. Don't get hit, please. Hey, near a little bit. We we did we did actually kind of travel. This one, this one is completely done. I'm back here now. Uh, as you can see, it's it's not completely done. It's save versus death on the Ankeg. Ankeg? What the hell is this? Horn Coral Gem. I think those are worth uh, some money. I threw one away. Ankeg Shell. The Ankeg is a burrowing insect-like creature between 10 and 20 feet long. Give me a moment. I'm going to have to convert that into metric for my poor European brain. Uh, 10 feet to centimeters, please. 10 feet to centimeters. Okay, and um, if we take 20, 20 feet to centimeter. Okay, between three and six meters long. Good. Uh, and found mainly in forests or choice agricultural land. They are covered with plates or shells made out of a substance called chitin. Chitin? Never know, I never learned how to pronounce that word. I know what it is. Gathered a lot of it in Val Valheim as well. Which is extremely tough and very light. The size, weight and strength of the shells make them highly sought after in many situations, including the creation of armor. Weighs a hundred goddamn pounds. I kinda want this with me. The only one who could potentially carry it would be her. I desperately need people who can carry more stuff. But that's not gonna happen, is it? Because I'm kinda satisfied with this party so far. Unless I find someone I really, really, really just click with. Because I have, I have two fighters, a thief, gotta have a thief. Or rogue. No, they're called rogues, no, they're called thieves, he, what, whatever. Thief, rogue. An actual cleric, uh, a druid fighter with healing spells. I don't mind having two healers and a spellcaster. Mm, are you gonna run around armorless for a while, maybe? I think so. Mm, I carry. Oh, I don't like that. You look so naked. But I wanna see if I can if I bring this back to Nashkel. Or th there's a smith in Baragost. Can I can I travel to Baragost without triggering anything to do with Transig? I think I might actually try that. Just to see if the Smith can do anything with the Ankeg shell. Also, Nera leveled up. 
What are you gonna get this time? You are fatigued because we have traveled very, very much. I wish I could just look at this, but I, I remember the green monks in the beginning talking about fatigue and morale. So I should probably take some sleep. Maybe, maybe I should have that as a... Um, get that into a habit that as soon as I travel to a new area, if it's 16 plus hours of travel, take a rest. Okay, level up. Uh, level up results. Two level two spells. One hit point. She went from four to seven to eight. One hit point. Yes, I know. There, There is actually an option where you can... Uh, where you can, uh, that you can enable, that basically makes you gain maximum hit die every, every level. I'm not gonna use that. Lore increased by three. Still don't know what that is. Will, will you forgive me? Uh, I'll just, I'll just search that for a moment. Okay. Lore gives a character a natural insight into discerning masked item properties. This insight continues to grow each time a character levels, but at a rate determined by its class. So, basically, it's it's kind of like in... Uh, shut up, stomach. Kind of like in Neverwinter Nights, then. Basically, a chance to identify magic items. Okay. Now, you do have um, this one. Just a lo just a long sword. Who has the most lore? Where can I where can I check your your people's lore? Lore sixteen. I, I'm not. I'm never gonna do anything. Uh, you're not gonna do anything. Nineteen. On a thief. Nineteen lore. You're you're definitely never gonna do anything, and you have turned undead. I have to remember that. Yeah. Imwen? I'm surprised. Can you, can you discern what this is? Identify? I guess... Not then. Since nothing actually happens. Okay. Well, I have my... Um, uh, and... and uh, Unkeg shell. And a uh, naked armor wise, Jahira. How may I be of assistance? And we're gonna keep uh, exploring here, see if we can't find Captain. Was it Brog? I think his name was Brog. Because it was some somewhat close to Brag. See if we can can't find Captain Brog. We got a 970, 75 experience from that one. Nice. But I'll I'll catch up with you if I find anything interesting. Well, I guess this might ca uh, count as interesting. I was traveling some mountains to the west of uh, Nashville when I walked up here and uh, accidentally, in self-defense, kind of slaughtered an entire Xvart village. Hey, self-defense, they attacked me, okay? <laughs> That's what every adventurer says. And here's Nick Slit, the Xvart. Saying, you monster, you kill us when we do nothing to you. Well, Ursa kill you. Ursa protect us because Ursa kind. Ursa, that sounds like a bear. Hey, Ursa the cave bear. Oh, I so okay, um, let's actually treat you as the probable bad thing. Your whole person only works on actual humanoids. Nera, just just keep on casting spells. Um, where are you going? Or, or, oh no! Run off the freak away! We're not we're not fighting that game. We're not playing that game. We're not playing that game. Let's see, Jahera is a tiny bit damaged. We have a, a few hit points missing on everyone. That's okay. Come here. Next slit the Xvart, badly injured. Freaking die them. Uh -huh. Except for you, Nera, you uh, do that on Ursa the Cave Bear. Good, and then the rest of you. 
Killers of the Cave Bear. Maybe I should actually... You two... Take care of the uh, experts. Take care of the ads. Keep a close eye on everyone's hit points because I don't want to die out here. Ursa's almost dead. Ursa dead. How may I be of Look in the smarts. Are you running? <laughs> well, that's the adventure life. You, sometimes you go out to find treasure and sometimes you just kind of genocide an entire village of things that attack you. Did Ursa drop anything? You have but to ask. I mean, I guess I suppose I, I should feel bad, but, you know, I don't. Because, again, self-defense. Sure, there are a lot of corpses here now, but that just means more money for me. And isn't that what, what adventuring is all about? Going out, finding stuff, being attacked by stuff, kill stuff that attacks you. Yes? Yes. And they are kind of fattening my purse, so that's good. Also, right, uh, I did the it, search the entire previous area I was in. Nothing really interesting happened. I ran into some gnolls and some kobolds. Then I traveled back to... Well, I was, I was gonna travel over to the west side of Nashville, but I got waylaid by enemies. And one of them... It was basically undead people. One of them dropped a angel skin ring, which I thought, ooh, cool, but no. It's just a ring made of angel skin. So it wasn't really interesting. But I wonder if there's anything interesting in this little tiny village they have here. Because once again, you attacked me. Me, I, I could have run. Could have ran, but uh, adventuring for self-defense only, or something. So yeah, this entire little village is now dead. Hey, one guy's still alive. Can't have that, can you? Ooh, three guys alive. Can't have that, can we? I mean, they're, they're gonna feel so... You, you guys scream so very much. They're gonna feel so very, very, very uh, lonely. So I, I, I say we, we made... We, we did them a favor. Also did find another... Lachlan's Minor Drain Scroll, which I tried to teach to Nera, but she failed to scribe. Oh, yeah, one of these. Can you succeed to scribe this one into yours? Yes! Third time. That means you can actually go up to 12 hit points if we use that one. You have but to ask. And drain for- Oh, hey! I guess they- I guess we just continue killing everyone in the village. Again, we just- Kind of run towards them and they attack us, and I uh, kill them. Adventure things. Oh, that looks like an entrance. Yeah, so I'm basically. I, I'm over here now. This one is done, this one is done, this one is done. I want to say this one is done. But I'm not sure. I don't think so. I thought that my plan was... I thought my plan... I think my plan was go down here and these. Because I kind of rushed through these two to get to the Norn Stronghold. Because Minsk kept kept complaining. Then I thought, what if I travel west from Nashville? And then this one popped up. So I'm, I'm going to go here. I'm going to go here. I'm going to go here. And then I'm going back to Nashville to sleep. And then I'm going to... I haven't been to Firewine Bridge yet. So this one, this one, this one, sleep, um, unless I need to go back and sell stuff. Then, um, no, screw it. After that, after I slept in Nashville, I'm gonna go direct directly to Bergost. See if I can do anything with this Ankeg shell. 
Svark village. <laughs> no more. Well, it is a village, but all the Svarts are dead. And that was a uh hot. -huh. Oh, a little oh, straggler. Really not in this. Uh, now I, I kind of need to kill them now because I want to use this place to rest. Ooh, there's a lot of people. I'm not really afraid though. Because they're, they're only Svarts. 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 They're a weird name, okay? Oh, I really not in this. They give a little bit of money, a little bit of experience points. I can, I can understand that Khalid's heart is not into this because it is akin to. Let's give them a right yeah. Maybe, maybe I do feel a little bit bad, just a little bit. But anyway, anyway, I'm, I'm gonna keep doing this, then I'm gonna rest, and then I'm gonna keep exploring, and I'll. Again, get back to you if I find anything else interesting. Oh, really not in Just west of the Xvart village, now during night, we find someone approaching us by the name of Borda. What do they want? Helvinae? No. Why, looky here, a finer bunch of adventurers I don't think I've ever seen. Hmm, though from the looks of it, you don't seem to be that well equipped. Well, you're in a lot of luck, I can solve all of your problems. I have a huge collection of potions and scrolls, all, all for a cheap price. Right now I can give you a potion of extra healing for 25 gold, a scroll of protection from petrification for 25 gold, or a scroll of protection from magic for 100 gold. So what do you say? Huh, how about all of them? I, I can just, no, we're, hero we're good guys, we're heroic. Um, I mean, Potion of Extra Healing always goes down well. Protection from Petrification is also nice. Or Protection from Magic. I mean, I have a crap ton of gold. But I want all three. Uh, protection from Magic. Say no more. We want that. This, this scroll is dandy. If you ever find yourself in a battle against magic users, just read this one off and you'll have no worries. Full item dropped on the ground. Really? Inventory full. Item dropped on the ground. Where's my scroll? That doesn't look like a scroll. Oh, there it is. Oh, I took, I picked up the scroll, but I dropped my antidotes. Can, can Nera actually learn that? I don't like that it's not identified. I don't like that it's not identified. Yeah, I'm holding off on using that scroll. So, never buy stuff from people you find out in the field because they can sell you counterfeit stuff, and it you you probably never run into them again. I'm gonna I'm gonna keep exploring. Well, this looks interesting enough. Just uh, north of the well, a little bit northeast of the Xvart village, I found a cave that has a cave bear in it. Okay, I shall attend that, to the tribe. That's. Uh, actually normal uh yeah i don't know why that's so surprising there's a cave bear in the cave of course there is 650 for a cave bear but also loot loot bracers I can't pick up anything though. Khalid? I can, but try. Do or do not, there is no try. So we have a potion of fire resistance. We have some unidentified bracers. We have an unidentified flail. Can you do anything with your uh, almighty lore?
not usable by Wizard Slayer and Kensai. You cannot do anything with your almighty lore, so your... Will lore ever be useful then? I mean, if you can't identify items we get now, just run Nashkel. Well, that was exciting. We found a cave with a cave bear and magical items. I shall attend to it in a truck. Back to exploring it is. Well, there was nothing else really interesting in that it map over there, so I took the chance to travel back to Berigost. Stay thy course a moment to indulge an old man. Elminster, I mean, uh, yeah. I've met him before. I was gonna say let's deal with this guy first. Well now, our paths cross once more, I suppose. Proper introductions are in order, as we will no doubt meet again. My name is Elminster. Elminster. Didn't I meet him, or was he only mentioned in camp in Baldur's Gate 3? With the whole Gale thing? I might be misremembering. I've heard nothing but tales of thy exploits in the time we have been apart. It would seem that thou art destined to have quite the impact on the Sword Coast. Quite the burden for one so young. I mean... Um... Just doing what I thought best. That certainly seems to be the case. Thine actions are a testament to charity and free will, whether intentional or not. But enough of my ramblings. Thou hast a long journey ahead of thee, and I will not have my meanderings delay thee. I will impart one piece of information before I go, though it is hardly a surprise, I am sure. The bandits that thou dost seek make a habit of traveling in the northeast. With this, I shall take my leave. I met that strange man again, though he now identifies himself as Elminster. All who walk the realms know this man, though what he should find of interest in me I do not know. I don't know this man. He said that the bandits I seek make a habit of traveling in the northeast. Again, I must wonder why my concerns are worth his attention. Yes. Anyway, I'm back here in Beregos because I thought maybe I should pay a, a visit to the smiths. The only thing I have to be careful not to do is go over here, because this is where Transig is. According to my journal, Transig is in Felderpost's Inn. So, stay the hell away from Felderpost's Inn. But I want to know if the smiths can do anything with the Ancake Shell. I shall attend to it in a trice. And I promise I shall not steal anything from your chests this time and draw the ire of the Flyman first. Ooh. An interesting piece of material you got there. Anchor, if I'm not mistaken. Been a while since I've seen the like, but if I remember correctly, it makes a fine set of armor. If properly treated, it's comparable to full plate with half the weight. Ooh. If you're willing to part with your shells, I'll give you 500 gold for the lot of them. No more can I offer with business as slow as it is. As it is. Iron shortage hurting us all. But, I, I wanted the armor. Can't you make me armor? Uh, if, if I sell the armor to you, if, if I sell the shell to you, will you make me the armor? Because full plate for half the weight, 25 instead of 50, that would be... Mm. Uh, I'm not hurting for gold, so I could keep it. The downside is that Jahera is still naked. Basically, Traveler's clothing is naked, okay? Okay. So she is taking a hell of a beating. Because I was kind of wondering to myself, why does Jahera keep getting hit? Because you stripped her of your armor, you... Dingus, you nincompoop, you dingleberry. Do I want to sell the armor? I mean, 500 gold is 500 gold. 
but if it's only for plate armor that only weighs half as much as full plate, eh, fine. You you have just bought yourself some anking, sir. Uh, pleasure doing business with you. Ah, uh, this will make a fine suit of plate for a governor or better. Nobility like exotic materials and don't care much about the price. Probably close to 20,000 gold for a 10 days work when I'm finished. I may survive this iron shortage after all. Damn you, sir. Damn you. One lousy ancake shell for 500 gold. I can't believe uh, everyone's not out hunting those monsters. I mean, dude. He could sell it for 20,000 gold. So if I find more ank eggs, I shall kill them. Because they're, they're worth 500 gold. Yeah, I have 3,900 gold. I am kind of rich. Oh, I'm going to have to find a lesser inn. Because... I know, Branwen, I know, Branwen. Hello? Who are you? Sasano, Sasano, someone in the jovial juggler gave me a gold piece to come find you. Uh, how do you know my name, child? Why, everyone here is talking about you. You're the ones who saved the National Mines. My mama says that even though we don't like those folks, folks from Arm, there's no reason anyone should have to suffer so. Um... Well, thank you, child. You have earned your gold piece. I will go to the jovial juggler and meet with your benefactor as soon as I am able. Good. You folks are real nice. Mama says the Sword Coast needs some real heroes these days. Taimora be with you, okay? <sighs> Casting spells A girl named as easy as Chloe told us that I'm someone tired. named Officer... No, she never named mentioned the name. She just said someone. Officer Vi is waiting at the jovial juggler. Which is... I, I guess I'm going to the Red Chief Inn then. Because I have... I, shall attend to it in I have items to identify. And possibly sell. So I'm gonna have to spend some nights just swapping out spells, identifying things, because... My lore... Gorion would be proud yes, of Brian would be proud of my actions. My lore is not good enough to identify stuff. Everyone I gather round. Let's see, uh, Nero. Yeah, that sounds good. Um, can you show them what you have to offer? And merchants. Ah, peasants room. We only need a peasant's room. We don't need a merchant's room if we're just gonna get... All right, uh, let's see. We have a few items. You don't have any on, have any on you. We're gonna have to make room for at least one. And why? Because that. Uh, all the fire burning. You can throw that. That's why you have it. The violet potion. Right, the freaking potions. Maybe I should just sell these. Because who the hell wants to go down to 3 dexterity and 3 constitution only for 25 strength? I mean, maybe. Maybe. With a big maybe. If increasing my strength increases my carrying capacity, but then it's still only for 24 hours, so it's kind of kind of useless. Yeah, let's put these on you. Let's remember to sell those. Now, who's carrying all the goodies? Is it Imwen? It's Imwen. And uh, you. I want to. I definitely want to see what this scroll is. Can I divide them? Imwen, very good.
Cursed Scroll of Weakness, motherfucker. This scroll is cursed, it would be unwise to read it as the effects could prove fatal. If I ever see him again... Burr something. I'm just killing him. Because he's a menace. He stole my money, and he's a danger for adventurers on the road. I just have to re remember his name so I don't kill the wrong guy with a name starting with B. Broda? Broga? He's dead. What about this flail? Flail plus one. So... Not useful. Because I don't think any one of us can actually use flails. No, you you have ac- I have access. Don't don't you look at me. I have access. You have long sword. You actually have a magical long sword. Harrower plus one. I mean, if this one hasn't broken in a, in a while, then maybe I should just sell the other long swords. So that one's gonna be sold. Ooh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Can you use flares? No, Warhammer and slings. Well, you can use flail. You have you have a Thaco of twenty with a Warhammer, and if you put on the flail, you still have a Thaco of twenty. Because you get 20 plus 3, 23, 22. So, oh, that sucks. Yeah, sell. Just sell that shit. We need a magical warhammer for you. Then we have the longsword. And the bracers. Can I give item inventory? God damn it. Um... Right, the Cursed Scroll of Weakness. I did pick up a composite longbow in case I get, ever get a chance to actually give her a longbow. Because I think longbows are better. Speed factor 6, requires 6 strength. Oh, never mind, requires 18 strength. Yeah, you can't use that one. Because you're nowhere near. 18 strength. Oh, <laughs> you are nowhere near 18 strength. <laughs> never mind, never mind. We'll sell that one. So, our second longsword is. Varscona plus two? Oh. Blades of this type were long used by Sharan priests. I don't like that. We don't, we don't like Shar around here. We don't like Shar. Uh, Sharon Priest during the sacrificial rites of Feast of the Moon ceremonies. Legends say that when she passed on, the remains of this sword's wielder were mummified and the blade was placed within her chest as a symbol of power. Her chest, are we talking, are you, uh, do you mean the uh, coffin or actually chest chest? Probably chest. In the first stage of a long forgotten ritual, she was to have been exhumed in a season, born again in some new form. Unfortunately, cult wars killed the few that knew of her existence. Her tomb became a prison where she was forgotten, and there she developed a rage that bordered on insanity, so the ritual worked, okay. Her grave was eventually found, but it was deserted and gave no indication of her whereabouts. Some venture to say that her anger was so concentrated that she became one with the very blade of her weapon. Regardless, after hundreds of years surrounded by constant hate, constant hate, the sword harvested a power of its own. It is now exceedingly deadly in combat. I'll say... 1d8 plus 2 plus 1 cold damage? Hey, Khalid. You has new weapon. Because this is just plus three versus undead. And then this one... Yeah, you have two magic weapons now. So 
This one just does more damage. Except if we fight undead, then you're gonna use the Harrower. Am I ever going to remember all this? No. Then we need to sleep another time because we need to identify the last thing. The, the bracers. Braces of defense AC8. Braces are thick bands of metal or leather that are strapped, belted, or tied to a character's forearm. Generally, the magic that is instilled in braces is good only during combat, since most braces help protect the wearer from injury or improve their chances to strike an opponent. Exceptions do exist, though such speciali specialized items are rare at best. So, in my group, those are not very good, then. Well, they do bring your armor class down to 5. What kind of braces do I have? De that gives dexterity plus 18. Yeah, I'm I'm keeping those. I have minus three armor class. This is so good. Okay, let's make the rounds here. You go down to five. Probably gonna be you actually, to be honest. Because you yeah, you would gain no benefit. You would gain no benefits. See? No benefit. You would gain no benefits. Yep, braces for my wizard. Maybe she won't get hit as much now. I, mean, I can actually combine those two and put up another 80 over here. Good. And use those, please. Use those. Then we change your level 1 spells back to... Magic missile. May maybe one minor drain, so you have some. Yeah. Oh, but sleep is good too. Sleep is so good. You do have a scroll of sleep, right? You do. You do have a scroll of magic missile. What do you have in your scroll case? Color spray, blindness. Protection scroll that is not identified. I have, a, I have another scroll that's not identified. I don't remember having another scroll that's not identified. Do you remember me having another scroll that's not identified? I don't think any of us remember how I am me having another scroll that's not identified. Protection from magic. This is an actual protection from magic scroll. A protection from magic scroll invokes a very powerful invisible globe of anti-magic in a three foot radius from the user. No form of magic can pass into or out of it, but physical matter is not hindered. This will remove the spell effects that the caster is currently under. Makes sense. The effect is not permanent and will wear off within two hours. Two hour anti-magic. That also means you can't be healed by Cure Light Wounds, though. Okay, it's 9 Intelligence. Do I have 9 Intelligence? Yeah, I have 11. I, my stats are pretty well rounded. Rounded, actually. I'm a good built dwarf. So, I will take that one. I already have a portion of invulnerability for one hour. Very high resistance to all attacks. I love speed. I should start using all my scrolls. Uh, potions. Instead of just having them here. Now we don't have anything unidentified left, yeah? Yeah? So I was just kind of looking at all these, seeing what scrolls I had. Burning hands is also good to have. Web. 
I mean... Eh. It's not so fun right now. Yes, fun. Shield for one hour. Sets the wizard's armor class to four against all weapon. Basically gain one AC then? Could be decent in a in a pinch. Wait. Oh, that's that maybe that's why you suck so much. Your Thaco is 23 when you're using the sling. Eh. It's fine. I I I just assumed she could use the sling. Oh well. She she really can't. Now, now we're done. Which brings me back to freaking spells. Definitely have a magic missile. Two magic missiles and a sleep. Because I think sleep is more useful than Larlock's minor drain. Because attacks against sleeping opponents never miss. Yes. So I have one sleep spell, I have a sleep scroll. You have but to ask. Mm -hmm. Take another rest in the peasant quarters. And you... We only have rumors here. Do you have any new rumors? We can't sell anything here. Not for fire wine, but for blood wine? Music... Disappeared. The influx of flaming fist, I know. Yes, yes. Okay, nothing here. I am proud to stand among such strong warriors. Yes, because you fell in with a band of mercenaries. Uh, bandits. But we, we are heroic. Khalid encumbered, slowed? Really? The hell? Oh, oh, right. Well, it's only a short trip to the smithy. I'm sure you can tough it out, Khalid. You must gather your party before venturing forth. No? Okay. None of that this time. Yeah, wait for me, guys! Come in! I shall attend to it in a trice. Me, me, me. I can make whatever you wish for a wee little bit more than me competition. You can make whatever I wish for more money than your competition. Do you do you ha have you made the um, armor thingy, or are you actually going to just sell that to the uh, aristocracy, like you said you would? Large shield plus one. Yeah, no, it's not worth 2,240 gold for that. He says between clenched teeth. The army side, the dagger. Let me, oh, I can actually sell the bolts here. Good. So sell all of them. Uh, can't sell any of the jewelry, though. That's a shame. Can I... I can sell all of these. See, see, I, I have, I have money here in the form of gems. Khalid, I am going to take a chance. A chance that. Oh, that's good. <sighs> Maybe brown one can learn flails. Uh huh. Keep the flail for now. I'm gonna take a chance on the whole magic weapons won't, will not break. Full plate armor. 
weight 70. Arm a class of one. 6,000 for two more armor class or two less, depending on how you want to look at it. It's not worth 6,000 gold. You already have a short sword plus one on you, don't you? I think. You keep the Warhammer because you currently have no magic weapons. Sell the longbow because 18 strength? Hell no. Can't sell the potions here, but I am going, I am going to sell them. Dart of Wounding. 16. I don't think anyone can actually use darts. Save versus death. Okay, I'll take 20 points of point. That's probably what the un Unkel, Unkeg, un insect thingy that was between 10 and 20 feet or 3 and 6 meters long. He would probably have poisoned me or acided me, so it wasn't actually death, death, just save versus death. Imon, can you use darts? Lore Knight, yeah, but no, no, you can't. So I might as well sell the darts then. Even though they are kind of cool. Twenty. Is that 25 per? That's 25 gold per. Four thousand three hundred and eighty-six gold. I am making my way up in the world. You have but to ask. Now, where could I possibly go? That's another inn, I think. I know I can sell stuff in here, but I don't want to go there. Oh, hey, right, Landrin's house. I went in there and killed a few spiders. This was a Kagane's shop. If, Kag if, if Kagane is home, I think I left him somewhere. Did I, where did I leave Kagane? Hell if I know. Maybe he went home. Maybe he went back here. Yeah, because Landrin's home, I went in, killed a few spiders, but I haven't found Landrin. I also still need to find Cold Kettle family and Joseph. This was just an inn, right? Come on, people, step it up. I shall attend to it in a trice. You want some whiskey? Yeah, okay, but I can't, okay, I can't sell here. But do you have anything? I wonder where those bandits came from. They seem to know exactly how to escape the first. Where do they hide? Must be somewhere in the woods. Northeast, according to Elminster. Lurian's burst ale. That didn't give anything. Iron's so scarce these days, you'd think it was as valuable as gold. Not a good thing, not a good thing at all. Keep an eye on your weapons and tools, they're getting expensive to replace. Can you actually see on the weapons if they're... The bandits might be using the woods to screen their movements from the flame and fast. So long, as long as that woods are, those woods are to the northeast, sure. But can you actually see on your weapons if they're gonna break? I don't think so. That would be kind of handy. Also need a... Right, I can Need a... God's damn... It shall be as you wish. Magic weapon for me. Kagane, are you home? Yes, I, I think you dealt with... Nope. Kagane is not you here. to ask. I don't remember where I dumped Kagane. I mean, I guess he was never actually a shop to begin with then. I'm gonna go loot his place. He is technically part of my party. I just, I just dumped him somewhere. 
Nein. Oh. Hoho. Hoho. Thank you, Kagane. Also, welcome. Proud to stand among such strong warriors. Yeah, just don't... Don't look at what I'm doing right now. Nope, nothing. Okay. Huh. I shall attend to it in a truck. So I think I think this one was locked. Yep. Sure, it's locked. But uh I've done had enough of this. It shall be as you wish. Hello? Elaine! Hey, come back here. I want to talk to you. You have but to ask. Never mind that I broke into your house. You said <laughs> something? Welcome, my dear. You are early. Uh, excuse me. Indeed, I was expecting visitors, but none such as you. Be gone before my company arrives. I shall, should not tolerate the mood being ruined by a band of miscreants. Okay. I'm just gonna loot your chest, chest and get out of here. Okay, it's locked. I'm not gonna lo loot that chest. I remember what happened last time. This was also locked. Because I've been in here, so... <laughs> You're a queer fellow. I mean, they don't seem I've to... I've done had enough of this. They don't I seem to mind resistance. me lock picking buildings. You have but to ask. Commoner. I was hoping to find Joseph or the Cold Kettle family. Even though I find so little fault with someone, I hope it lasts. Oh, you startled me. I'm not used to strangers because traveling is so dangerous now. Please don't linger too long here. The children are leery of anyone they don't know, and it is hard enough to keep them calm when there's just me around. Ah, oh, if only my husband hadn't gone to work in the mines at Nashville. So your husband is one is one of the dead miners. Also, are your is your stuff locked? Yep. If you don't keep your stuff locked up, then I'll take that as an invitation that it's uh, free for all. For you, commoner. Bam. Who you? Hello? Why haven't I gone in here? Everyone, gather around. Boy. You have but to Mother ask. said not to talk with strangers. Ah, uh, you scared me. I wasn't taking anything. Honest, I was just checking out the house. That's all. Someone's got to watch over the place because I'm sure they'll come back. The Grey Carts only went to Baldur's Gate to visit and they should be back already. I'm gonna wait right here till they, till they do. I have a feeling they're dead. Damn. Oh, I can go upstairs. You have huh. to ask. Could I, could I have done that in Elaine's room too then? Oh. Who are you? I thought no one lived here. Okay. Whatever. It shall be as you to me. Brat. Well, I guess I can go down I here then. Ask. Okay, please, please, Transic, be inside Felder Post because I don't want to trigger that. I. Proud to stand among such strong warriors. You're already in the party. You can stop brown nosing. As I do not want to trigger the whole uh, Transic thing yet. That's just assuming he's still in there and he's not hiding among his. Um... Okay, please look away, sir. I'm gone. Thank you. you yeah, assuming he ask. hasn't gone to hide with his uh, bandit compadres in the northeast. You have okay, so here, ask. no one is home. Do you have a lot of locked chests, though? 
You have and I mean, ask. if you find a chest in an empty house and no one is there to see you pick the lock, is it really a crime? Is it really? Because I mean... Uh, I've done had enough of this. Lockpicking in itself isn't so bad, right? It's only if you take things off. from the chests. Imran, move. See, no flaming fist means it wasn't a crime. Yes. Let, let's go with that. I shall attend to it in a trice. Why do you people keep your doors locked? I am gone. I mean, I don't, as I mind it's free experience. It shall be as you wish. Joseph, call Kettle family. I mean, I think. The Kolkettle family thing, didn't I find that among a field of corpses, basically? And I don't remember where I found... What is it this time? Joseph's greenstone ring. Oh. It's money for a rainy day. Thank you for investing your money in gems. Easy for me to find a fence and get rid of it. One of fire bead. You think Landron's home? Have but to I mean, it's on the way to the jovial juggler anyway. Or will Landron's home now be infested by new spiders? Also, where the hell did those spiders come from? How come no one saw them or heard them or caught us on? Hello? Are you interested in some thrill style? <laughs> the curve is more powerful than the sword. But what if you have a curved sword? Hmm? Ever thought about that? Hmm? And you have the best of two worlds. According to her. Landron? You have but to ask. No. Nope. No landry. I kind of wanted a small reward for clearing out the spiders in your house, but sure. It shall be as you wish. Yeah, everyone this way. Stop going your own ways. Okay, let's talk to this supposed officer Vi. Can I assist you? There she is. Ah, Rosardos, I thought it might be you. These southern parts are set quite afire with talk of your work in Nashville. I am Officer Vi of the Flame and Fest, uh, and to be honest, I could use your help. Um, You can either be a douchebag or a brown noser. Y yeah, I'm, I'm not going to be a, be a douchebag. I'm honored to be found worthy of your notice, officer. How may I be of assistance? My contingent and I are cut off from Bowler's Gate. We haven't received new orders for close to a week, and, to be honest, I don't like the feel of this at all. The bandit raids have been getting worse since you returned from Nashville. Well, yeah, I, we kind of know why. Uh, I used to think that they were just your usual brigands out to make a quick buck in troubled times, but not anymore. Do they actually use the word buck? Isn't that kind of specific for the dollar currency? I don't know. Um, I'm working for someone, one way or another. I've got to get my troops back to the gate. I'll pay 50 gold pieces for every bandit scum. Motherfucker. I sold my bandit scalps. In Nashville. And spread the news, I want this whole region cleared before winter comes. 
Oh. <sighs> Officer Jessify of the Flame and Fast uh, is marooned in Burgos with her contingent. In her desperation to return to Baldur's Gate, she offered me 50 gold points, gold pennies, gold potatoes for every bandit scalp I can bring her. She'll be waiting for me at the Jovial Juggler Inn. And, uh, Dribbles in the region, just in case uh, I m managed to, uh, you know, progress the story. Uh, bandit scalps. Uh, thy juggler, Burgost. Collect. And don't sell them for 25 gold in Nashkel. I shall attend to it in a trice. Yep, well... Uh, oh, maybe I can... Maybe I can go in here. Maybe, maybe someone lives here. I shall attend to it in a trice. Someone does live here. Let's see if I can get in there. Th this looks like a big house. Maybe a certain Cold Kettle family lives there? I mean, I don't have a quest for them or anything, but I have their amulet. Someone has to, I mean, be interested in, in where I found it and have it returned to them. Same with Joseph's Greenstone Ring. One, two, three, four, five. There's my sixth member. Get inside there. Colcato family. Joseph. You have but to ask. Anyone? Commoner. Hello, mate. You look a friendly face. Ah, but what right are ye in my house? <laughs> I'm sorry for intruding, but I was just wondering what you were doing. I was kind of spying on you through the windows, and it looked interesting, so I went in here, since you didn't lock your door, and uh, just chicken. Or just, uh, my apologies, I must have the wrong address. I will leave immediately. And well, you should. If my husband were to catch you here, it would surely be the end of you. Uh, there's six of us, dude. Do that. I'm gonna you loot your house ask. just for that. Damn. As a, if anyone's in the houses, I am not I shall attend going to, to. Well, I could unlock them for the experience, but I'm not going to loot anything that I lockpick. Gonna loot everything that's not locked down, but I'm not gonna loot anything that, that I lockpick. Well. That was not a cold kettle family. And I do believe that I have not been in every house in this city. There was another house here. Colin Vend. You were the guide guy. Right. Oh? Locked, you say? This way. Okay, everyone, move the way. So Imwen can sneak up I've and... I've done had enough of this. I shall attend to it in a trice. Yeah, open, open the door. Go in. Another commoner. You have but to ask. Why well, it's been getting prickly on me eyes? Burglars, explain thyself, lest the guards lose you from your life. Um. No need to call the guards, I just had a desire to see this fine house from within. That will go over well. I don't know whether you're a fool or a liar, but it's best for thee that I cannot decide. You have a chance to leave before I call the watchman. Best that you make your ne next move a wise one. Okay, fine. Oh, you have get out. Because we kind of are burglars. At least he didn't have a purple burglar alarm. Well, I think um, that does it for this one. Uh, didn't get much of anything done. 
Found out that I could do the whole quest log thing for myself. Found Elminster again. The bandits are to the northeast. Sold the um, uh, Ankeg shell for a pretty, pretty 500 gold. Well, I guess we did finish this quest we didn't have, and we finished uh, the prism quest. Uh, got this one. We're not going to complete this one. Because I don't care. 50 gold? Have you seen me gold? I don't need 50 gold. Gorion would be proud of your actions. Yeah, but I think that next time I'm gonna go for the... Maybe the half ogres. Let's see, where are we? Yeah, maybe maybe find the half ogres down here somewhere. They were to the, to the southeast. So if I go here, maybe if I go there, because I I think I, I think I've explored that one. If I go there, could also be down there, because that's that's very southwest. So the plan is basically bang, bang, bang. But uh, that's next time. For now, leaving this here. As always, thank you for being here and thank you for watching. I do hope that uh, you have a splendid continuation of your day or evening or afternoon or whatever it is where you are or what you're doing. And please, take care of yourself.